Shifting focus to Nepal, now troubles for the Nepalese Prime Minister Sher Bahadur Dewa is far from over. Now over an American grant worth $500 million are from over. The Millennium Challenge Cooperation Nepal Compact has failed to take off after the ruling coalition remained sharply divided over its parliamentary ratification. Now, amid ongoing controversy, Nepal's Prime Minister has made a fresh pitch in favour of the project. He has said that the project is within the legal framework and is not contrary to the nation's interest as claimed by many. Deoba has also said that he has been speaking to his alliance partners to assure them that the project is necessary for the country. The U.S. assistance project MCC is in Nepal's interest and the agreement is necessary for the development of the country. This is a grant which can be utilized in the development of Nepal. MCC is within the law of Nepal, but people are not acknowledging this. It is time for people to understand this and read MCC project first. I am the Prime Minister of this country and I did not find anything that is contrary to national interest. How can I go against the national interest after having fought for democracy and leading the nation? I have been hiding discussions with all alliance partners on MCC that it is in Nepal's interest. Prime Minister Deoba has been pushing the MCC through the House, but his coalition partners are dead against it, saying that some clauses must be amended before the compact ratification. Nepal Parliament's winter session commenced on December 14th, but was later called off for a week after opposition parties obstructed the session. The Millennium Ch Challenge Corporation's Nepal Compact was to be tabled in the Parliament, but it made no headway. Prime Minister Deoba is also facing immense pressure from the United States. Washington has reportedly given an ultimatum to arrive at a decision soon. Two recent visits to Nepal by high-level U.S. officials also signaled the urgency of the matter. Now, the hold-up in ratifying the MCC is not just because of Nepal's domestic politics, but also geopolitics. Dilemma for Deoba has deepened due to increasing competition between United States and China and the race between the two global powers to expand their projects in the country. While the fate of MCC hangs in the balance, China has also expressed interest in implementing the Belt and Road Initiative Agreement. Sources say Beijing has also put pressure on Nepal's politicians to not implement the U.S. project. The Millennium Challenge Cooperation Nepal Compact was signed in 2017, aiming to counter China's Belt and Road Initiative. It comprises of two main projects, which includes a 300-kilometer electricity transmission line and an upgrade to a 100-kilometer east-west highway with about 6,000 big and small rivers. Nepal offers a huge potential for hydropower generation.